So we have five questions from the ECOB community for you. Okay. So let's get started. And if you wouldn't mind, please be concise in your two minute answer. Okay. Climate. Is human activity to blame for climate change? Will putting a price on carbon make a difference? Oh, I don't need two minutes to answer that. Is human activity responsible? Yes. I mean, that's been proven. And in terms of pricing pollution, uh, it's recognized not just by our government, it's recognized by economists, Nobel laureates, uh, even Brian Mulroney and, and Rana Ambrose from the Conservative Party that putting a price on pollution is the most effective way to deal with what uh, reducing carbon emissions. We can start to change behavior. It's, it's transparent. We're returning to uh, nine out of 10 families are getting more money back. So absolutely, it's the right way to go. And um, we're in a crisis. We need to, to, to make change on this. So we'll be asking five questions, all from the ECOB community. And thank you, ECOB community, for um, engaging in these uh, federal election interviews. So if you would, please be concise in your two-minute answer. The first, climate. Is human activity to blame for climate change? Will putting a price on carbon make a difference? <clears throat> We all know we have major environmental issues, but the People's Party of Canada do not believe we have a climate emergencies, emergency. Um, the People's Party of Canada is the only party that do not, does not believe taxation is the solution. The People's Party of Canada will not have a carbon tax like the Liberals, and we will not have a cap and trade, which is more expensive and harder to get rid of than the Conservatives will introduce. We believe in lower taxes to solve environmental issues, and we we'll believe that the provinces should have more say when it comes to solving environmental issues. So let's get to those questions. We have five questions mm -hmm. coming from the ECOB community. And if you wouldn't mind being concise in your two minute answer. Sure. So let's get started. Climate. Is human activity to blame for climate change? Will putting a price on carbon make a difference. Absolutely, yeah. Um, I mean, this is the, the Green Party really is the only party that has a target of a 60% reduction in greenhouse gases by 2030, so that's 10 years. And we want to completely eliminate uh, greenhouse gases by uh, the year 2050. I know that the Liberals have a, uh, their, their plan is, uh, is improving, but it doesn't quite get us to where we need to be. And I think uh, elected members of the Green Party can hold the Liberals to account if they don't keep their promises. Uh, the Conservatives, I, I listen to their platform as well, and they are going to rely on, uh, on corporations and businesses to, uh, to meet their targets. But um, I mean, for the last 40 years, uh, corporations have really made the problem worse, not better. So I'm not sure that they should be the ones that should be put in charge of this. So uh, the Green Party will invest in uh, renewable and green technology. We're going to invest in 21st century technology which will not only help the environment, it will also help the economy. And so that's why I think the Green Party's plan is the best one. Thank you. Let's get to our five questions. And these five questions came from our ECOB community. So thank you again, ECOB community, for getting these topics to us. Climate. Mm -hmm. Is human activity to blame for climate change? Will putting a price on carbon make a difference? Sure. I think um, when it comes to climate, um, a lot of things have been done over the past, you know, 200 years. And um, we're now kind of starting to realize those problems uh, now and trying to find solutions for them. Um, the New Democrats have come up with a, pro uh, a solution, which is really investing in jobs as well as offering a big stimulus plan um, of up to $15 billion uh, towards 300,000 new jobs and um, a clean solution for people in North uh, Oakville, North Burlington, for um, commuting with electric vehicles, um, free transportation, public transit, train, electric trains, um, and I think that those are the real solutions that can help us here in this area. Thank you.